Chevron is seeking to recoup $485,000 in litigation costs from a group of Nigerian villagers who unsuccessfully sued the big energy company over the shootings of protesters who occupied an offshore oil rig, a legal move the Nigerian's attorney says was designed to scare off foreigners from bringing similar lawsuits in the future. Two months ago, a federal jury in San Francisco cleared Chevron of wrongdoing in connection with the confrontation in May 1998 on a barge tethered to a Chevron oil platform, during which two villages were killed and two were wounded by Nigerian soldiers summoned by Chevron. The villagers say they were peaceful while protesting the company's hiring and environmental policies in the Delta, but Chevron's witnesses testified that the protesters had threatened violence, held crew members captive, and demanded ransom. Chevron, which reported a record $23.93 billion profit last year, is seeking to recover an assortment of litigation costs from 49 Nigerian villagers. The Nigerian's attorney, Teresa Traber, says that it's doubtful Chevron will ever recover its $485,000 because, among other things, the villagers are poor. She says the people Chevron seeks to bill for the legal costs include a number of children as well as the family of a man who was killed on the oil platform. Traber said, quote, it's a political move. It's designed to say to the world, don't sue American corporations regardless of their practices. If you lose, we're going to go after you for costs.